everybody welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel so today we are playing another part of generations and i think our girl nicole is pregnant you want to know why you want to know why you see this little mood lid right here all right so it says nauseous nicole isn't feeling so hot you may want to keep around the bathroom for my no causes okay so i'm gonna go ahead and start eating our watermelon because, like, I need a girl. I do not want all boys. I need a girl. And I think we also have the fertility treatment. So that should be quite interesting. It is also Parker and Landon's birthday. I went ahead and gave Mr. Oliver a little haircut. I feel like he's going to be more of a um, rebellious child. I have a feeling. So he's very grumpy. So I have a feeling that's going to go over very, very well. You are in big trouble, young man. You better not do that again. Maybe you should help out around the house and get on my good side. What did he do? From skipping school. Go to school, dude. I know it's your birthday. I know it's your birthday, but go to school. Gonna have her eat some more watermelon. I don't know why it keeps popping that up. And then we're gonna go ahead and teach Oliver how to um, talk. And you need to go to school, sir. Is he peeing or what? He's taking a big fat dump before he goes to school is what he's doing. And he's off. Off to school. Good job, Parker. You're already late. And you're just in here sleeping. It's your birthday. It's your birthday! He's gonna be a big boy! Look at this. And he's learning how to talk. He's so cute. Oh, we're about to throw up. I need to go ahead and make their birthday cakes and probably throw another party. I don't know if I want to, though. We also need to start using our uh, video camera. Um, we do need to potty train him. She wants to bounce on the trampoline. I don't think he can do that while pregnant. Oh, we have to stop because she's nauseous, but that's okay. We can go ahead and start cleaning up the house. We need to go ahead and put the toys away. And um, maybe if we have twins or something... This will be their room because it is the biggest room in the in house. And eventually, if we end up having more kids, we can always turn the daycare into something. And we can always turn the office into a daycare or whatever. But we definitely need to have the house clean. And I think what we're going to do... I want to hire a maid. So I think we might call for services and hire a maid. Uh, we need to clean that up. We need to clean this up. Um... We need to turn this off because I don't want to have that. And then we need to clean out the fridge. We need to put away the leftovers of the cake. And you also need to attend the school today. And, um... Attend ceremony at public school 67. Is there another school? Oh, there is. Wow. Wow. He needs to attend his, uh, his ceremony is what he needs to do after school. And then, uh, we can have his birthday party. Um, you need to actually be attending to, um, maintaining stuff. Um, besides sitting on the computer and not doing your job. Go ahead and have some quick breakfast. And we can go ahead and maintain everything. So, we need to maintain that. And maintain that because it is pretty bad. We also need to, like, harvest some of this stuff because I kind of want to take it home. Um, but he's going to do that at work for a little bit. We're going to go back to Nicole oh, while she's cleaning the house. All right. Okay, Nicole. How are we doing, sweetie? Are you feeling nauseous anymore? Really, really want to hire that maid. We also need to eat another watermelon. I don't know if she's going to find out she's pregnant in this part, but considering we did woohoo kind of throughout the night, so I don't really know when exactly she's actually, when she's actually, actually, actually going to get pregnant. <laughs> that was a lot. But we're going to, <gasps> I don't want to adopt. No, cancel that. Oh my God, cancel that. I don't want to adopt. Hold on. Cancel adoption. No, I don't want to adopt. I wanted the maid. Can I cancel the adoption? 
Can I cancel the adoption? That's not what I wanted to do. I did not want to adopt. Oh my god. That's not what I wanted. Okay, so it's uh, uh, Landon's birthday. So we're actually going to come over here and give him some attention because it's his birthday. Tickle him. Snuggle him. And then we need to come down here and make his birthday cake. I can't believe I accidentally clicked adoption. How did I think that was a maid? How did I think that was a maid? I'd be so heartbroken if this tiny fire destroys. Oh, is he on a fire? No, he's just swimming. He's swimming. Not putting out the fire. I don't want to adopt. I'm glad I can cancel that. I'm glad because if you have to go through with that, that is just bad luck on your half. Ooh, ooh, girl. I did not want to have to adopt. Did she ever make the cake? She needs to make the cake. And he's just going to clean our house, which is nice. Love having people clean my house. Really do. I really appreciate it. Eventually, we'll cancel it when I have more help around the house. Um, he's going to attend his badging ceremony. He is super duper tired. Parker, Parker, Parker has a recital. The entire household will try to attend if they make, if they can make it. Oh, they're all going to go to his recital. How cute is that? Actually, I need you to put out this fire. What the fuck, dude? Why didn't you put out this fire? You're going to go to a ceremony, but not go to the fire. Oh my God. I'm gonna where he's gonna lose his job. He's gonna lose his job. Go put out this fire. Then you can go to a ceremony. My goodness! It really Oh my gosh, okay. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on, too much is going on. Collect service award? Ooh. Need to do that, but I also wanted to, um... Okay, so I guess we're not going to attend his recital. But Nicole will, so that's okay. Call a babysitter. Nicole will, um, go to his recital. And, um, Will will just go get his, um, his little thingy majiggy. Did she ever make that cake for him? Or am I gonna have to buy them? You should have a nanny here. Uh, she did make the cake. Okay. But the nanny is here to take care of you guys. So you're, you're fine. Take care of his needs. Oh my god, she did not give him a bottle. Okay. So you're done. You can come home. But he did get his trophy. Ooh, where are we going to put that? Ooh, where are we gonna put that? Do we put it? Oh, that's huge! What the hell? No, he's aging up already by himself! No, I'm a bad mom! I'm a bad mom! He's aging up! I feel so bad! I feel so bad! He's aging up! Oh no! I feel bad. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Due to your excellent parenting skills, you would choose a trait for uh, Landon's development. Oh no. I'm going to have him be athletic, kind of like his dad. He's kind of going to be like our sportsy dude, um, is what I'm going to have him be, but. He aged up without a cake. That is so sad. That is so sad. I can't believe I did that. Go change your appearance. I feel so bad for him. Why would you take your bike home? I feel so bad. Oh, no. I feel so guilty he didn't have a cake to age up to. That's awful. I'm a bad mom. I'm real bad. <laughs> I'm real bad. I'm real bad at mom stuff. <laughs> oh, Landon. Cute. He is such a cutie. Cutie potato. 
Uh, we're gonna get him this hair. I feel like that would be good. And we'll give him some little eyebrows. And that will be good for him. We'll give him some contacts to make his eyes pop. But that's about it. He real cute though. I feel like he looks like his dad, but he did get his mom's, like, hair color and stuff. I feel like all the kids got, like, Nicole's jeans, like, a lot. Um, we're just gonna give him some contacts, make his eyes pop and stuff, and then let me out. And then I'll change his outfit, like, off camera and stuff, because that can honestly take me a while. And I will also decorate his room off camera. But I will take you guys along, and we will, um, give him a bed. That's what we'll do. So delete that. So he's not gonna have a jungle theme anymore, which is oh, quite sad. But he will have a nice little bed, a nice little bed, and we'll give him a bunk bed. Um, I am thinking sportsy, sportsy. So we'll do this bed. We'll just put it like right there, and we'll keep the brown for now. But I will give him new bedding. Uh, I think we need to go with, hmm, let's go with themes. Uh, let's see. Is there any sports stuff in here? Not really sure. I think I did have a sports kid once. That is not sports. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm just looking for something. I think it's this. Yeah, it's this, but we're going to do it. We'll do it like that, I think. And we'll make this a little dark. I'm not really sure. It'll probably change eventually. Um, but for now, he'll just have, like, that for- I don't know what else to give him. Like, I- I don't know how I want to decorate his room for for now. That's just his bed. That's his bed. Um. But he does need to go potty, which is what he's doing. And he also needs to shower and, uh, eat some din-din. So we'll have some cereal for him. And you need to come home and blow out your candle. Oh, no, I guess you can't. I guess he's- gonna do it right here okay he's gonna age up on the side of the road all right all right all right congrats parker yep yay you're gonna age up in a bad mood and um on the side of the road okay yep yep everyone can witness okay all right due to his difficult indifferent study habits well he had it he had an a he had an a uh, you will not be allowed to choose Parker's traits. Uh, Parker has developed the no sense of humor trait. Uh, of course he has. Of course he has. Go home. Who is this grown ass man celebrating our son's birthday? Who are you? Parker, go home. Oh my god, what a creeper. Nicole, did you go home? I need you to eat a watermelon. Wow. Wow. Poor Parker. Oh no, he's gonna pass out now. Parker is having a shitty day. Parker is having a real shitty day. Parker's curfew is in one hour. Oh my god. Oh my god, I feel so bad for him. Oh my god, Parker! Okay. Uh, go home. Try and go home. Try and go home. You're not far from the house. Just try. Try your best. Alright, he made it home. I'm gonna have him go straight to bed. He's gonna go straight to bed. Because, um, he's exhausted. He's exhausted. I am so sorry. I am so sorry. I feel so bad. I feel bad. Okay. Can you come over here and, like, finish teaching him how to talk? I don't care, mascot. I really don't. Dude. Landon, go to sleep. Go to sleep, dude. Go to sleep. I guess for uh, Parker's birthday, we'll just get him a new turtle. Like, I don't know what else to do. 
Eat your watermelon before you go to bed. And you can actually stock the cage then. We'll get him a really nice turtle. For 30 simoleons. And that'll be his birthday present. Um, he's good on food, but, um, sorry, Parker, I really, really do apologize for your birthday. I hate that it sucked, but we're going to have Mr. Cole go to sleep. Um, and Will is just teaching, um, little, little Mr. Oliver how to talk. Cuties. Are you done? Are you done? Can you not teach him to talk anymore? Alright, guess we're gonna have him go to bed. Alright, don't yell at your child. He's just tired. He's just tired. Eat your watermelon and chillax. Eat your watermelon and chill. It is a-okay. It is a-okay. So he's tired. You're good. Alright, so I'm actually gonna have you wake up for a little bit. I don't know who this bitch is. Um, and I'm gonna have him take a shower and we're gonna change his appearance on camera. Just so he can get a good look on what he looks like. And I think I want to put him like in a beanie. I don't know why. I just, I want to put him in a beanie. I mean, why not? So let's see what Mr. Parker looks like. I'm excited. Oh, I can't believe, I hope we have a girl. Next, I really, really, really want a girl. Uh, all we have is boys and I just, I'm not here for it. Boys are a lot of work. <laughs> Girls are also a lot of work, but we're we're pretty easy to deal with. Oh, that was a big ass lie. No, we're not. I'm sorry. <coughs> yeah, we're not easy either. But I just want I just want my little girly girl. Like if I just had one girl out of four kids, I'd be okay. I'd be a okay. But we're just gonna put him in a beanie. Um. Let's see. Where's that one beanie? I have this one. I feel like that's not really him. I feel like that's more his brother, Oliver. Um, I have that one. But I feel like this one works. I feel like this one works. And I love it. So we're going to give it to him. We're going to give him that beanie because I think it's so cute. Come on, let me out. Sashko. There we go. There's Parker. He's real cute though. A real cute. Yep, but so. that's Parker. All right. Let me out. Thank you. I'm wondering if she's going to get pregnant, but I'm just going to have him go back to bed. Oh, he's going to do it anyway. Did you see your turtle? Oh. Nicole's pregnant. Nicole's pregnant. She's pregnant. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to have eat a wa extra watermelon just in case. Because I ate watermelons all day. So you guys can't tell me I did not eat my watermelons before she got pregnant. Alright, well now that she's pregnant, we got one baby on the way. We have one teenager, one child, one toddler. And we're about to have a newborn. So, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked this video, hit that like button. So if you liked the video, leave a comment in the comment section down below. And hit subscribe and tell the notification so you know when I post. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.